So in our last video tutorial, we discussed, uh, we learned how to divide a monomial by a monomial. And in this video tutorial, let's learn how to divide a polynomial by a monomial. Like in this division of two algebraic expressions, 4y cubed plus 5y squared plus 6y is a polynomial because it has three terms. And in this algebraic expression that is 2y, it is a monomial because this algebraic expression has just one term. So polynomial divided by a monomial. Well, you can do it by two different ways. And let me show you how. So basically this is 4y cubed plus 5y squared plus 6y divided by 2y. So you can write this as divided by 2y. Right? Okay. Now, if you look here, you have 2y. We can write this 4y cube as 2 multiplied by or in this way, 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by y squared multiplied by y, right? Then plus, this is 5y squared. So let's do one thing. Let's take 2 here and 5 by 2. That is, you multiply and divide by 2. Basically, what you have done is, you have done 2 divided by 2 multiplied by 5 multiplied by y squared and if we write 5 y squared as y multiplied by y 2 divided by 2 means what just 1 so 1 multiplied by 5 y squared will give you the same term and we want to write this as 2 multiplied by 5 by 2 um, both are the same thing and why we have done I'll explain you then you have plus this is 6y, so write it as 2 multiplied by 3 multiplied by y and now you have this 2y, right? Okay, now this 2, this 2 and this 2, this y, this y and this y. Three terms, 2 and y are the two factors that are common, common in each term. Take it out, so you get 2y multiplied by y 2y squared plus 5 by 2y plus 3, right? And in the denominator, you have 2y. This 2y, this 2y gets get cancelled. Now you understood why did we take uh, why did we multiply and divide this 5y squared by 2 by 2? Just to get this 2y, the two factors common so that we get we can cancel this 2y by the 2y in the uh, numerator. Now you have 2y squared plus 5 by 2y plus 3. This is the quotient or the answer of this division. Now, don't worry, these, uh, you know, these tricks or methods to solve uh, by uh, taking common factors and all, you will learn once you will practice, practice and practice and practice. Mathematics is all about practice. Okay, so uh, this is the answer. And now let's divide this by the method of, okay, let's keep it here. Let's do it by the method of monomial by monomial. How? This is 4y cubed plus 5y squared plus 6y. So this is basically what? This is 4y cubed divided by 2y plus 5y squared divided by 2y plus 6y divided by 2y. Right? Why? Because if you have 2 plus 3 plus 5 divided by 7 that's actually equal to 2 by 7 plus 3 by 7 plus 5 by 7 so same thing we have done here okay so now from here now you can apply the uh, laws of exponents that we have done earlier this is 4 by 2 multiplied by y cubed y plus 5 by 2 
multiplied by y squared y and this is 6 by 2 multiplied by y by y. From here, this is 4 by 2 means 2, y cubed divided by y that is a raised to the power of m divided by a raised to the power of n is equal to a raised to the power of m minus n, the, law of the laws of exponents. So this becomes y squared plus 5 by 2 and this will be y from the same law of exponent exponents and this is 3 y by y means 1 so you can clearly see that these two answers are actually the same whether you now in this case what have you done actually this is actually monomial by a monomial division of a monomial by a monomial if you separate uh, each terms of the numerator but with the uh, denominator okay so Let's move to the next. This is 24x squared yz plus xy squared z plus xyz squared divided by 8xyz. Okay, now this is basically what? Divided by 8xyz, 8xyz. Okay, so what we can do here, this is 24, write this as 3 multiplied by 8, very nice. Now, this is x squared yz, so write it as x multiplied by x multiplied by y multiplied by z. Let's use this here. Then you have plus x multiplied by y multiplied by y multiplied by z and plus x multiplied by y multiplied by z multiplied by z and here you have 8xyz okay now x this x this x y y y z z z common take it out 3 multiplied by 8 multiplied by x y z within the bracket you have x plus y plus z the distributive property of multiplication over addition this is 8xyz now xyz xyz gone that is x multiplied by y multiplied by z this is also x multiplied by y multiplied by z here you have 8 and 8 gone you have 3 multiplied by x plus y plus z so this is the answer okay now you can use the another method also that is by using the division of a monomial by a monomial and how I'm writing this as this is 24 so this is common this is basically what 24x squared yz by 8xyz plus 24xy squared z divided by 8xyz plus 24 x y z squared divided by 8 x y z now this is basically what this is 24 by 8 multiplied by x squared by x multiplied by y by y multiplied by z divided by z then plus this is 24 by 8 multiplied by x by x multiplied by y squared by y multiplied by z by z then plus this is 24 by 8 multiplied by x by x multiplied by y by y multiplied by z squared by z so from here 8 24 by 8 gives you 3 this is x squared by x will give you x and this is y this is y this is z this is z so 3x plus 8 divided 24 by 8 gives you 3 this x gone this z gone and you have y squared by y it means that this is y plus 3 and in this case you have z now this 3 is common this is equal to 3x plus y plus z so this is exactly the same answer what we got uh, earlier by using the method of common factors okay so this is the last example here you have 
7 x squared plus 14 x divided by 7 x. So basically this is divided by 7 x means that this is 7 x. Okay, so here we can write this as 7 multiplied by x multiplied by x plus this is 7 multiplied by 2 multiplied by x and divided by 7 x. This is 7 here, 7 here, x here and x here take 7 x common and inside the bracket you have x plus 2 and this is divided by 7 x. Now this 7 gone and this x gone you have x plus 2 as the answer of this division or the quotient of this division. Right? So this is the way we perform a division of a polynomial by a monomial. In the next video tutorial we are going to discuss how to divide a polynomial by a polynomial.